Hello, I am Munir Hawk and you are watching Developing Simple Quiz Android App Development Tutorial in Kotlin. This is the fourth part video of our Simple Quiz App Development series. In this tutorial, we will add some quiz or game logic in our app in order to generate quiz questions and answers. Let me um, clear this thing. Uh, as of now, we got a uh, we got our title fragment and clicking on the title fragment takes us to the quiz fragment here we can see some text boxes but there is no question here and no answers in this tutorial uh, we will add some logic in the quiz fragment quiz game fragment so that uh, these questions can be generated so let's do this first of all we need a model class to represent our questions and answers so we will create a data class first right clicking here and new Kotlin class and we give the name of this class is question and it will be a data class data class and the name will be the question and it will contain two parameters first uh, the var and the question the question and it will be type of string and as i as uh, as from our example each question have four multiple multiple options so we will create an array list or list of answers so it will be where the answer which will be a array list of string array list of string okay now we will uh, create some values uh, for the in this uh, in this tutorial in this example actually we will use the array list as a static data type and later on this uh, tutorial we will use uh, either uh, firebase data collection or firebase uh, firestore or uh, any web server but for this simply for the simplicity uh, in this stage we will only use uh, array list as static data okay we will go back to our quiz game fragment and here we will uh, create some instances of our question oh, it will be a var var questions and the questions will be a array list array list of array list of will be this will be question and here we will uh, any we will instantiate right like question and the question first to just give a uh, question like states does USA have this is the question and we will uh, create another uh, uh, another the uh, parameter the answer will be a, another array list so this will be a array list array list of say uh, we will put those options here like 50 and say 45 sorry 45 and 51 and 44 okay so one thing please remember that uh, we need to uh, we need to track also the right answer so in this case I am putting my right answer in index 0 uh, the first options so you can also you can uh, you can make another parameter to uh, to keep track of the right answer 
but in my case I am for the simplicity of this application I am keeping the right answer at um, index 0 and we I will later shuffle it and uh, show you how to shuffle those uh, options and keeping the uh, tracking the right answer okay so I need some couple of questions so I will copy paste it uh, I already have done some right written some question so here I will simply copy paste okay I will put the download link of these questions in video description please get those questions from here from there now I will uh, declare some variables which I will use later to generate those questions like that you need for uh, I need to know the current question so current question which will be type of this question also I need to know the question index and for this uh, for the first time uh, I will add uh, the question index at 0 so question index I will assign it as 0 I need uh, the, the first question okay also because we are here are some couple of more, more like eight or seven or eight questions uh, I will put some maximum number of questions to appear so it will be uh, val max number of question questions it will be let uh, let it be three you can put any number here or four okay fair enough now I would uh, use the answers so I can let in it for answers answers and the answers will be array list of a string so array list of string okay and finally I will track down the selected answer so let in it for and it will be selected answer and it will be obviously a string okay so all things set now now we will uh, use the set question we, we need to know the set question so how can I do it so we will create a function like set question so it will be private fun set question and and inside the uh, inside this function I will add the current question the current current question which I used here the current question the current question will be the questions the, the questions here is the questions questions and its index will be question index the question index so question index okay and I also I will also um, take make an another array list of those answers so here's the answer answers so answers and answers will be array list array list array list array list of what array list of array, uh, array list of current questions dot answer so current questions dot the answer okay array list i think oh, okay array list okay and what else i can do i can do the uh, i will uh, there is a built-in function called shuffle I will use that shuffle answer 
and source and source dot shuffle okay so what does that set question uh, set question uh, function do when I call this function we will get the current question from the question and the question index and then we will get the answer of from the current question and we will shuffle this answer now we have said those answers we have shuffled those answers we will also need to random or shuffle this uh, question also these questions also so how can i do it i can create another function like private fun random question random question and i will simply uh, shuffle this question list like questions dot shuffle okay and from here i will call the uh, set question method so set question and actually in this tutorial i will only uh, add some logic to generate the question so uh, check uh, wh whether it is working or not so i will uh, create some log so inside the set question log sorry, log dot d and give a tag name right like answer group answer group answer group and uh, will be the actually answer group is this answer so i will <coughs> excuse me answer and it will be uh, index 0 because there are uh, four uh, answers in a uh, there are four answers four answers uh, for each question so answer one i will check on all these things whether they are working or not this is only for uh, demonstration purpose so i will add simply copy paste here it's one it's two and finally three. and we will also uh, print the uh, real answer so it will be log.d and it will be answer real answer real and the the, uh, the real answer is be it will be current question and we know all those right answer is on index 0 so it will be real answer and current question dot the question sorry the answer question dot the answer and it will be the this thing okay let me run this app well i forgot one thing to uh, call this function so i will call this function from the on create view of this fragment so random this question and then I will uh, run this app. So this is our app and I will go to the log cat to track down the logs and I'll simply copy it, the answer and put inside the log and I need to uh, ensure that the my running device is uh, running device is emulator pixel 2 emulator pixel 2 and then when i press the play i can see that see, this the log is working and it's saying the answer group is 14 april uh, 21 february and this is actually this uh, this the, this um, this question and here 
the the answer group has been shuffled shuffled like like the question answer group is shuffled from here and the real answer i can see the real answer this 26 marks uh, which is on the index zero as uh, i already have told that um, uh, uh, the correct answer is will be on the uh, answer uh, will be the on the index zero but we we have already shuffled it and we get the real answer okay so let me check one uh, once again i will go back and play and randomly another question is selecting another question is has been selected and i can see those answers random answers and the real answers so the, this is the uh, this is uh, all about our tutorial uh, although we got those um, answer group and answers but uh, we haven't uh, show this in this answer text boxes uh, we will show the answer uh, question and answer on the text boxes on the next tutorial uh, using data binding so that 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 is a, uh, that will be a very exciting tutorial and please watch the next tutorial until then thank you